exemplary soldier, Stealth Elf. But that just means I expect more out of you than anyone else. The ninja's work is never done. I'm ready for anything, Buzz. A ninja after my own heart. All right, head out and use your deadly circle slash to complete your first mission. Okay, so, uh, <laughs> tried to showcase one of those kills here, and the Greeble just sort of like fell through a crack. So I'm thinking we're just gonna go off to chapter one. Uh, the problem is, he kicks these guys pretty far, and if they get out of the arena, it's a done deal, and they've got decent health, which is actually good in most cases. <laughs> but I'm trying to kick him the other way, I really am. Let's just let him come in here. <laughs> and a little, cl little closer. But that said, did you know? Like, there we go. Oh no, I thought we'd killed him. Don't go through the crack, little buddy. Did you note the favoritism he played? I mean, uh, it's no secret, Stealth Elf uh, is one of the developer's favorites, particularly a Toys for Bob guy. I think maybe the head of Toys for Bob, if I remember right. And so... <clears throat> <laughs> Even Buzz reflects that sentiment. It's, it's pretty interesting stuff, right? Man, this is gonna take a long time. The good news is Chompies are one hits, and you're done. And I honestly think we could be done if I had gone to chapter one. Come on, man. This is... I'm trying not to launch him up there and have... Oh... Okay, well... Uh, I'm Lesson learned. I'm gonna head off to chapter one. We've got... Pretty close to 20 chompies there at the base level. Then you come up, three pop out, and then you hop in that crate where the king chompy is. You got enough. Uh, just make sure you do your you know, certain dedicated attack, in this case, or circle slash or the tertiary. So we will go do that. I'll get it cranked out. I'll kind of record that for you. We'll come back. We'll see what Buzz has to say and assign us with a stealth stinger. And then what I'll do when I go in to do Nightfall in Chapter 3. Uh, or, I mean, yeah. Yeah, chapter three. Uh, we'll come in and we will do chapter four, where we have good access to a lot of kills we can get with a uh, sky vehicle. So stay tuned for that. I will be right back, and you will see Stealth Elf slaughter her quest in no time. Uh, much easier, actually. So one second. Hey, everybody. I want to wheeze them here. We're in chapter one. We're about to head up the Chompy Bridge here, as I've lovingly named it. And... This is what we're going to do, and we're going to wreck some chompies and take care of her quest, so... Why is it not registering? Let me jump back out. I want to check this. That is a concern. Zero? Oh, four enemies at once. Crud. <laughs> okay. Let me get rid of that stupid thing. So, let's see here. This is gonna be tougher than I thought. Like, are we not getting four at once? <laughs> Come on, we didn't get anything there? This is ridiculous. That should count. Well, this is a bit disappointing. I don't know where we're supposed to get the ability to have four at once. I mean, like, I felt like we did it a couple of times there. Let's see what we can do in here. So we're really gonna have to grind this. That's gonna suck. Well, I'm gonna go and uh, we'll figure this out, so stay tuned. Everybody, hey, when we's merely left at three in the morning now, and I figured out a way to do Stealth Elf's quest. And it's uh, the good news is, just like with the sea vehicles, boxes, uh, crates, and 
course, uh, oil barrels, things of that nature count. Uh, so anytime you have four of them, uh, you're pretty well good to go. And you can also kind of string two together sometimes. But like right over here, you've got one, two, three, four. So I mean, that would technically count. So that's the good news. And then it is possible to get a few of them uh, in kind of like the chapter one, the usual location, uh, right after the chompy ramp. However, you kind of have to position the chompies and then kind of spam why you can't just you know press it once and hold it or something you kind of have to string a couple together and sometimes the game will give you credit for it so uh, that said pretty much anywhere that there's a lot of crates uh, I wanted to test it out upstairs like Stick literally here at the Academy program, and see if that would work so there, I don't think do I've completed it with Dark Stealth Elf but I think I did start it or something. I can't remember for sure, but I'm going to actually test that because, you know, that room where Glumshanks hangs out, that's always crates. You sometimes get wish stones where there's, like, nothing that's ever really significantly been added. That would give you ample opportunity to get several taken care of there. But uh, anyway, so we got that done. We're going to go see what we get from Buzz here. This will set up her second quest from him, which should be uh, based upon a stealth stinger. So... Let's get that going here. I knew I could count on you, Stealth Elf. Oh, great work! They never saw it coming, Buzz. <laughs> Here's a little something for your trouble. Alright, so plus five critical hit. I'll take it. I would have preferred speeder armor. But nonetheless, can't complain too much. That said, I'm going to can it right now because I'm going to use this next clip as the end of this video and, of course, then the start of uh, Quest 2. So, here we go. I see you came prepared, Stealth Elf. But are you prepared to do what it takes to get your supercharger skills to the next level? Silent or not, my Stealth Stinger and I are up to the challenge. I like your commitment to excellence, Stealth Elf. What you need to do next is use your forest fog to lose some enemies. Alright, so there we go. That is going to be her second quest. Again, I'm going to use that kind of as the start of that video so it can be properly introduced. But <laughs> Anyway, I was trying not to yawn. I'm very tired. Uh, so I think I'm going to get these videos couple of them edited and maybe uploaded here. I've got videos for days, man. It's a pretty good feeling, but uh, what I'm going to do now, I guess I'll switch over to Nightfall, kind of will showcase what she gets for completing Sea Shadow's quest. She'll be ready to take on the Supercharged Challenge, but uh, we can now go ahead and access uh, Stealth Stinger's portion of Stealth Elf's quest here from Buzz, so we'll, we'll look forward to that. But uh, as always, thanks so much for watching. You know... Let's go ahead here, let's pull Stealth Elf, and these quests are, I mean, they're totally redundant, you have to realize, uh, for the alt decos, you know, Silent but deadly. and I swear I've been getting the same hats multiple times, it's very odd, so, let me see, Catch a glimpse. whoops, wrong button, alright, why, hmm, Let's go ahead and uh, talk to Buzz again here. I could have sworn I'd started this. You are one of our most exemplary soldiers, Stealth Elf. But that just means I expect more out of you than anyone else. A ninja's work is never done. I'm ready for anything, Buzz. A ninja after my own heart. All right, head out and use your deadly circle slash to complete your first mission. Alright, so sadly I broke those I'll be here when you're ready. that were right there. However, we've got some crates down here. This should totally... I don't know that it counts here at the Academy, we're going to find out. But if you see something like this in the game, Chapter 1 through f whatever 50-something there are, it counts towards your quest. So let's see if it does here. Yep, we are awesome. Uh, okay, so this is going to be pretty cool. Oh, Persephone with the martial hat. That's, that's a nice touch. I like Persephone. Uh, this is only three. Sometimes it's incredibly stupid. <laughs> but I can't do it there because the fiery forge. But you can literally kind of like push the crates and barrels around. Like right there, that would be... Oh, I didn't know you could do that. Um, 
<laughs> it might count with the sky diamond. I guess we could find out. Yeah, it totally did. Oh, don't break it. I'd rather have an elite and get the money. So, that said, though, this is like a total cash cow for this thing. Assuming it works, I think it should since it did down here. But, uh, that green flame is pretty good looking. This might actually work too. It's more than four. Oh, yeah. This is good stuff here. So, this is why you watch my channel. It's these little things like this that make your life so much easier. Dun 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 dun. You always wonder what this was for. Apparently, it's to help stealth elf. So, what do we have? We've got four right here. Let's position that a little better. See what I mean? And then you've got four right there. And then you've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven or eight more right there. So, <laughs> there's that one. And then, can we divide these a little better, maybe? I'm trying to, like. Oh, yeah. Let's situate these. Come on, come on, come on. Alright, so this should work. <laughs> oh, this is cool. Alright, so let's just be ridiculous and, like, <laughs> masterfully. I'm the probably the first person ever to take the time to segregate these crates into 4x4 uh, four four groupings. <laughs> but, hey, you know, that's what we do. Uh, we we are conducting Skylanders research that no one else bothers to do. So it's up to us. If we didn't do this, who would? You know, if we're not up until 3 a.m. Uh, to provide these types of answers to people that probably aren't asking the questions, who would be who would be filling this role in the world? And I don't know that anyone would. So check this out. Whammo. All right. And right here, sadly, we end with five crates. So you know, it's kind of a Kind of a waste of one crate, but I guess that's insurance policy. So right here at the Academy, we've already gotten seven of them. And as you should know, anytime you like enter a chapter, do a race, do a supercharge challenge, things of that nature, the crates are going to respawn. So there might actually be a way. Oh, yeah. Well, I wonder if the... F okay. I don't think we can pull it off with just the full crate. Okay, but, uh, hey, we're doing good things here, so let's see if there's a way to get the crates down at the engine room area, uh, able to work with this. You might actually be able to manipulate some of the legendary treasure items, even. Uh, I was kind of wondering, there might be a few more places in the academy, there's usually some crates right up on the top side of this, but let's come back here and see what we can do. Alright, there's actually, although I've got this pretty well junked out with legendary treasures, uh, what is here? Just two, sadly? So again, you could technically move those if you wanted to, but I want to see if there's any easy ones uh, that you can get in here into groups of four. I think we can probably do it. Oh, I was afraid that would happen. <laughs> I think that top section might actually be four. Or is it just three? Ah, uh, it was just three. And yeah, we couldn't string it together there. But. So yeah, I mean, the main thing, though, that room, if you're having trouble with this, just go upstairs at the academy, and it's simple, simple stuff. So uh, this, I think, is four. No, that's another three-peater there, isn't it? Well, that's sad. But again, you could kind of, I mean, if you want to take the time to do it, you could totally divide these crates up and push one of them down there and kind of have it go in your favor. So uh, that said, that should help you out, get you going here on uh, Stealth Elves Quest. So I'll probably take care of Dark Stealth Elves in that manner. It's seeming like it'll work out quite nicely. So nonetheless, hope this helps you out. Hope you learned a little something. We'll get to play with the Stealth Singer, get it properly introduced, supercharge, and check out the attack damage, things of that nature. So stay tuned for that. But uh, until then, you can follow me on Twitch, follow me on Twitter, like me on Facebook, circle me on Google+, look at me like Rizzo, whatever you prefer. Uh, once again, Skylanders Research is the series. It's what we do. We hope you like it. If so, leave a like, leave a comment. Your support is much appreciated. But until next time, I will catch you back for another thrilling installment of Skylanders Research. <laughs>